All right. So, uh, naputol yung ating discussion about the architecture of India. So, this is a continuation of the discussion. So, uh, like what I've said a while back in our previous video, the Taj Mahal is a mausoleum complex na matatagpuan sa Agra, Western Uttar Pradesh state, ta Northern India. And this one is considered the finest or uh, pinaka-example ng Mughal architecture. Kasi meron siyang, uh, it is a, it's like a blended of Indian, Persian, and Islamic styles. So the Taj Mahal is also one of the world's most iconic monuments visited by millions of tourists each year. So again, the Taj Mahal, this was built by Emperor Shah Jahan for uh, his queen, Mamtaz Mahal. So nandito yung uh, itsura ng tomb ni Shah Jahan and ni Mamtaz Mahal. So next we have Chanburi. This one is the largest and deepest steep well in the world. So ganyan yung kanyang itsura. So yung Chanburi, this is a steep well built over a uh, thousand years ago. Steep well or step well. Step, uh, by step siya. So the Chanburi, this, uh, this is a step well built over a thousand years ago in the Abhaneri village of Rajasthan. And it is one of the largest step walls in the world and also one of the most beautiful ones. So dito, uh, located siya sa eastern part naman na province of Rajasthan and it was built by King Chanda, kaya Chandaburi. And the Chandaburi is not an easy landmark to find because it is one of the hidden secrets of India. And yung step walls na to, katawag nga rin Chanaburi. May ano siya parang ito yung isa sa mga tourist spot na nagbibigay ng uniqueness sa India. And the well sub stuff built into the side that lead down to the water. Kaya kung mapapansin niyo yung mga hagdan na to, yung mga steps na to, yung mga ladder na to. Ah, uh, ito yung way para makapunta dun sa well. kasi 'di ba well siya para makakuha na water. And yung Chanburi, one was built during the 8th and 9th centuries. And meron, so sinasabi na meron daw siyang 3,500 na narrow steps na naka-arrange in perfect symmetry, which descends 20 meters to the bottom of the well. And centuries ago, the steples were built in the arid zone nga, sa Rajasthan. And today, yung mga construction is not used as a well anymore. Parang hindi na siya ginagamit as a well or balloon. But it exquisite geometry attracts local and international visitors. Parang hindi na siya ginagamit as a well, kundi parang ginagawa na siya as a tourist spots. So ito yung kanyang pinaka-well. And para makapunta ka dito, you will uh, uh, go down using this step wells, these narrow steps. And lastly, Lastly, Indian Air Architecture have this Lotus Temple naman, which is now found in New Delhi. And this is a house of worship. So yung Lotus Temple, it is a symbol of excellence in modern Indian architecture. The Bahai, Bahai House of Worship, popularly known as the Lotus Temple, is not only a symbol of excellence in modern Indian architecture, but also one of the most visited religious building in the world. And the temple located on nine on a uh, nine point seven hectare site near Nehru Place in South Delhi. So, etong Lotus Temple na to, it is a place of worship open to all races, religions, and castes. So, meaning hindi lang siya pang uh, Hinduism, Buddhism, kundi open for all religion. So, the form of this house of worship takes the shape na lotus yung flower na considered na sacred by most Indians. And it is designed to reflect the simplicity, clarity, and freshness of the lotus temple or yung bahay faith and to act as a symbol of the unity of mankind and religions. And yung structure ay composed siya ng three ranks of nine petals. Right? Uh, nine petals each and 
spring from a podium which elevates the building above the surrounding plane. So the first two rungs curve inward, parang ini-embrace nila yung inner dome, while the third layer, eto, eto, parang ini-embrace nila yung inner dome, and etong third layer, which is this one, ay curves pa outward naman to form canopies over the nine entrances. So, yan yung ating Lotus Temple. House of Worship na matatagpuan sa New Delhi. So, this is the plan. As you can see, there's a pool. Ayan yung mga pool. Uh, sa outer hall, may mga bridges and entrance. And these nine reflecting pools surround the buildings and therefore suggesting the leaves of the Lotus. And yan yung uh, parang pinaka-design ng Lotus Temple. So, yun yung ating Indian architecture. And dun mag -e end yung ating topic which is the arts and crafts of India. So, I hope you learned something and na-take down notes ninyo yung mga important terms and important things regarding this lesson. So, life is a work of art. Make yours colorful. Have a nice day.